Hey, checking in with my daily update and I've been getting planned and prepped and ready for the week, as is my usual Sunday routine. Uh, it always makes me feel a little bit more in control when I've sat down for 20 to 30 minutes and done that. So managed to get that one done. <laughs> I've also been working a little bit today on putting together an article ahead of the um, uh, Men's Health Day, International Men's Health Day, which is, I think, next week, this week, coming on the 19th. Um, so I've been asked to write an article for that. And actually, it's a really good prompt because I haven't written an article for quite a while. And um, I've had a sort of an outline of it in my head and uh, just decided that I actually had a spare moment today. So I'd sit down and write it. It's only short, but something else I can use to, um, well, see, help to um, not just create some awareness of men's health and men's mental health in this case, but actually there's some, in this particular article anyway, there's some, um, hopefully some useful advice and suggestions as well. Um, and uh, that sort of links into some of the other things that I've identified that I need to work on this week, including completing the, uh, the app that I'm working on and some other content creation as well, because they are some of the things that have been slipping by the wayside over the last few weeks that I've mentioned previously. So getting back on top of that as well. Um, it does look like I've got another fairly busy week this week and then a potentially reasonably busy week next week. It depends. I'm still waiting to hear back from one particular engagement that might mean going back down to Plymouth again. Um, but then it does start to get a little bit more sparse and um, it's not too bad. And of course, we've got Christmas coming up as well and things do generally quiet down over Christmas. And now I've got a fairly busy January, but I know that I'm at risk of feeling like I'm not busy and therefore I'm not being productive and therefore I'm losing momentum. And um, I've certainly felt like that before and it's it, it feels quite um, uncomfortable. Whereas I need to keep an eye on the balance here because I know that this is normal. I think there's a, it's possibly driven partly because I was hoping to get a couple more things in for December and they may still happen. But um, because I'm looking at my diary thinking it's not how I wanted it to be for December, uh, it could certainly trigger a little bit of a, um, uh, a moment of or two of anxiety and worry and panic and doubt and all the rest of it that, that often comes with that. So I'm being very mindful of that this time. Um, and uh, yeah, of course, I'm not letting my eye off the ball. I am still going to try and get some of those sessions booked in. If not for December, then certainly for into the new year, even though, as I said, I've already got quite a busy January, certainly with Gen Healthy Minds work. But uh, yeah, that's my update for the day. As always, thanks for watching and thanks for listening. Bye for now.